This video is brought to you by Dr. Kristen R. Bromley's Guitar Method Book Series and Online Music Academy. Hi, I'm Dr. Kristen Bromley. Welcome to my online academy. I am thrilled to be here helping you with learning to play the guitar. So, in this quick answer episode, I'm going to talk about slapping the strings as a muting technique that can be inserted in the middle of a strumming pattern. So, first of all, the slapping technique is to just slap the strings, and it creates this sort of percussive sound. It mutes the strings from ringing when we do that, but it also creates a percussive sound as the strings slap up against the frets. So when I'm doing this, I'm holding a pick. You wouldn't have to be holding a pick, but I usually use this under part of my hand where my fingers are and just sort of slap down with my closed hand the way it is right in the middle of my strumming. So just slap right down upon the strings and actually if I do it too many times in a row it doesn't feel so good. But it's just a slapping technique, sort of digs into those fingers a little bit now that I'm just thinking about it. Don't usually think about it. So I have a great strumming pattern that uses this technique on the board. This is a 4-4 pattern. I play with this pattern all the time. It's such a fun one to use. So this pattern employs a little rest in the middle. If you don't know what rhythmic notation, how it works, you can check out my quick answer video on that. And you can learn about these symbols up above as well. I also have it written here. The little rectangle sort of looks like in the yard where you hit the croquet ball through, but it's a three-sided rectangle. With published music, it's a darker line at the top. That means that we strum down over that rhythmic figure, and then the V, like a U with a point at the bottom, that's kind of a way to remember it, is the up strum. So this is strum down, up, mute, the M for mute, down, up, down, up. So we got this little rest, we're creating this rest in it. This is a pattern I use all the time when I'm wanting this sort of a sound. So this one sounds like this. demonstrating it on a G chord. So I'm going to work with you to try and build up to this. So we have two eighth notes, down, up, and then we have a mute on beat two. So it's just down, up, slap. That's all we do. Down, up, slap. Sometimes, by the way, I will bring, just turn my wrist over a little bit and slap the strings with the meaty part of my hand. So that sort of the palm part there instead of the back of my fingers. It just sort of depends on the moment. But down, up, slap down, up, slap. That's all there is to that. Down, up, slap. The hardest part is catching this eighth note on the end of two and putting the down strum that goes there. So you got down, up, slap, down. Again, 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 and down, up, slap, down. And down, up, slap, down. And down, up, slap, down. Okay, now we need to add up, down, up to the end of that on and four. And down, up, slap, down. Up, down, up, 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 just like that. Let's try practicing this or employing this with this chord progression G, E minor, A minor, D. So G to E minor to A minor. And D. Just go ahead and join me. G minor. A minor. E minor, sorry, A minor. D and G. E minor. take it a little bit faster. So you can have one, two, ready, and...
I will sometimes do to create sort of a relaxed feel that I want on some songs. And that is I turn this into a dotted eighth followed by a sixteenth. So it makes a delay on that upstrum. So you get this down, up, slap, down, up, down, up, down, up, slap, down, up, down, up. It's kind of a quick little turnaround on that up to the slap. So. That's a fun thing to do. Let's try throwing that in on this chord progression now. So you got one, two, ready, and G. strumming pattern. Hope that helps and I'll see you again. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. For more in-depth lessons and to progress through a free guitar course, check out my Guitar 101 series on YouTube and my Guitar Method books, which all come with access to hours of in-depth video lessons. You can find more information about me and my products at kristenbromley.com.